so let's get into it let's get into it check in to dr parker's office for your vision test baby we need to see are you seeing this situation this person clearly like is it clear let me Doesn't need to go crazy. I let it rain and clear it out. I let it rain and clear it out. I let it rain and clear it out. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Here we go. Chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup with a soda on the side. Shout out to you if you know what that's from. If not, you can get it tuned. I'll link it down below. I will link it down below. I don't even remember what it's actually called. I'll link it down below. Chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup. Chicken noodle soup with a soda on the side. Chicken noodle. Chicken noodle. Chicken noodle with a soda on the side. I let it rain. Okay. Clearly, Dr. Parker is lit. We don't play them lame games around here. <laughs> Group selections. If you are drawn to the letters largest in the group above the red line, then you resonate with group number one. Now, if you feel more drawn to the smaller letters in the lineup, this means that you are more so resonating with the letters below the green line. So you are group number three. Anything between the red and the green is group number two. Or you could just select one, two, three. Whatever you feel guided to do. All right, all right. I'm gonna let this continue to burn. Burn, baby, burn, burn, baby, burn. And let's get into the pick a card reading and let's find out where do we need to adjust your vision, okay? Whether you are group number one, two, or three, or anything above and in between. Let's go ahead and get started. Yeah. Okay, so if you are group number one, the letters above the red line, also the largest letters in the lineup, then this is your reading. And your reading is talking early before you even came in, before I even turn on the camera. And I would like to point out that I'm seeing 888. Eight, eight. These two cards fell out just like this. Eight of Cups reverse and the Eight of Swords upright. For you, the reason why you are seeing the biggest letters and debatably the easiest viewed letters is because all it's taking is a tiny adjustment from you with the eight of wands at the bottom of the deck again that eight 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 with the eight different i mean the three different suits of all eights we have the eight of swords eight of cups eight of wands only thing missing is the eight of pentacles like literally doing it it's like i feel like you are thinking yourself into a into like a circle where you just kind of like keep thinking in the circle and you never take that action but all you are is like one step away from getting it done like you are just literally just one step away from getting it done you're not that far off okay so i'm gonna continue your reading And I feel like you may be psyching yourself out of this because you're thinking that it has to be harder than it needs to be. King of Wands here. Oh, you just need some support, man. You just need to ask for some help. Just be like, man, yeah, the strength card here. Like, can somebody come with me or can someone like do this for me, with me, show me how to, so you need to ask a question ask someone to go with you or something you just need to ask network reach out but this is <laughs> it's definitely 
I guess it's like it's a it's a vulnerable ish state for you I guess for those of you that selected this group specifically because I feel like you just you kind of stay to yourself it's not that you are isolating yourself on purpose this is just kind of like how you are yeah like you thrive alone you thrive on your own at least in in most cases in regards to whatever this specifically is this is you stepping out in a way that you usually don't okay we have the five of wands yeah and it's just making you a little nervous but it's really nothing to stress yeah the lovers here ask for support that's all it is you just have to ask for support wherever it's needed and only you can know where it's needed i feel like this is someone needing to like yeah like literally will you go with me will you do this i don't know like and then we have the six of cups here yeah like you just need emotional or moral support or something like that that's why it's like a easy solution if you will please stress that that's in quotes because what is easy um and what is the solution if not just unlocking the door to more problems but not problems it's just this is the process like i don't know it's just kind of like i feel like there's this disconnect in a way where because maybe you are looking at every new situation as a problem as opposed to just another thing to like do uh, i feel like we're putting too much pressure on something and that's what keeps us in that like running in a circle thing but it's really not all that like i'm getting like you've done a lot bigger things okay i don't know something could be more comforting than you think okay we have loyal heart yeah so you just need some moral support man that's it you just need someone who can give you a heads up on something like if you're going to school today for the first time and you just need some advice you're like hey bro or hey dad hey sis hey whoever we have not for you at the bottom of the deck it's not for you to not make a move i just got a notification it's like doesn't that yeah because that that fortune cookie says nope like you're not meant to get stuck you're not meant to get too comfortable this six here is representing that equilibrium that homeostasis within and it's like i feel like you i feel like there's this disconnect between good nerves and anxiety in a sense if you will like just working through it what is this showing up yeah the nine of wands working through it cautiously um looking for or asking for support where you can provide for yourself and make yourself more comfortable like i'm getting like as if this was a chess game you're like mm, i can't make my next move until i get a sip of water man you know like i don't know it's like just asking for for comfort like if you need a blanket ask for a blanket if you cold let them know if you hot let them know you know like it's something like that something it could be very simple or it could be more intricate we have constants see but it's bound to happen it's just being put off Mm. this is so like ominous i don't know it's like and you may be very surprised what comes of it and that's all i get like it fell out like this and then it comes like this and you may be surprised what comes of it with the accent like very specific oh yes yeah, interesting just do what you do take that chance make that move and i'm seeing the color white is standing out here white and red so it's definitely about starting a new fresh something in that root chakra getting something new going okay new 
the whites being renewed, refreshed, restored. Red, root chakra. So you could probably benefit from those colors, meditating with them, or do what you do. But this is um, all that I have for you, group number one. Again, yours is a, quote, simple solution, if you will, because it just takes you taking one or two certain new footsteps in a new direction, and then it becomes your new norm. And you just need support right now with Loyal Heart, the Six of Swords, um, this King of Wands looking over this Eight of Swords, this Eight of Cups. It's just, I'm a little nervous, you know, like I'm a little nervous. Like, mm. But this could be like a little pride getting in the way, and especially with the Six of Cups here at the bottom of the deck. Um, this could also be like um, shaking some sort of codependency from your past, from your childhood days or maybe it wasn't even that long ago you know like you're trying to shake it now this is something that you're being called to to do to ask for the the appropriate attention i just saw 818 and appropriate attention seems very specific pray about it call a friend about it look in the mirror about it But I do definitely feel for the majority that, that there is um, a physical form of support that you can call on to make you feel a little bit better about this choice or decision needing to be made. But this is all that I have for you. If you'd like to book a personal reading, very first link in the description box, the goddess of the unknown. Ugh, dang it. Very first link in the description box, the goddess of the unknown.com to book your personal reading today. And I'm going to go ahead and get into group number two. Group number two, you selected the middle line, the mid-sized letters that are between the red and green lines. There's something about choosing a side or making a choice, making a solid decision and then actually making it happen. I just heard registering for the fall. Someone wants to go back to school, this is your sign. We have the Three of Cups. We have Justice in the reverse. This could be Libra season. Five of Wands came out. Clarify the Three of Cups. Temperance. Yeah, Ace of Wands. I'm quiet because there's a, a debate here. There's like, there's many choices that could be made. Many different directions that could go, that we could take. But there's definitely something new wanting to be started here. Strength reverse. Give me some time. Definitely keep hearing the word registering. So, and I keep hearing like registering for the fall. Or reg registering the feeling, like taking in the feeling. Four of wands. Despite what may have not sparked, what can you do? This is calling us to be honest about where we can actually make a move, take action, to contribute. Now for some, this is also like a third party situation. There's a lot of energy in this group. 
which just leads me to believe that balance is being sought here which is why that justice card is in the reverse yeah like there's something that we've this group wants to have a, a sense of control or progress towards something specific or maybe even not so specific but you just want to feel like you have some sort of stability progression something solidified by now I feel like you're looking down a specific road saying this. Like you may already be established in some way or another or many ways or another or other ways. But there's a specific route that you, yeah, like it's something narrow because it's like you're in the center of the, the card, um, like the group selection. And then here, I feel like this is being in the middle, like it's structured. What can we add? Deep knowing. Ooh. Shoosh. I just almost made my smoky quartz do a cartwheel in front of me. Between worlds. See, yeah, like this is where you would feel unstable. I'm hearing dissolved. I'm hearing the word resolute outcome I, yeah I just feel like um there's a new beginning wanting to be started here yeah with wedding at the bottom of the deck yeah a new commitment like when I think of registering it's like for some with the four of wands it could be talking about um home yeah and as I said that I just saw the room card uh, this could be for those of you trying to become homeowners, stepping into some sort of ownership. Okay. And then we have the thief card in the reverse. Yeah, like that's giving me like a, something that they can't take from me, you know. Even again, maybe some of you already have like your own house. Your See, look, a lord. See, this is someone that owns land, like property, things like that. That's what I'm saying. So that's why I feel like this group, the energy was more like shaky because this is definitely a big decision here. Yeah, with fortune. This requires getting some things together, like changing some things up. This is a new form of structure. I'm hearing like I want to have something under my belt. this is just you I, i'm getting very strongly like wanting to go back to school or wanting to go to school period or wanting to apply for that place that loan that car i don't know there's just something like it's it's a big boy big girl it's a it's an adult decision you know like there's definitely some adult decisions being made here okay um and that's why i feel like it's very broad because i feel like there's so many different choices wanting to be made here for some this could be um the back of my earring keeps falling out at like the weirdest times anyways um so weird it never did that before but anyways you could be wanting to leave one relationship or one job for another um i feel like for some of you something else has stolen your heart that could be a person place or a thing honestly take it as it resonates but it's definitely something about wanting to go somewhere else like newfound lands and i just keep hearing redefined structure and with this deep knowing i feel like it's like this sense of familiarity like i really feel like this is ownership for sure like whether you want to um have that license have that um that job have that i don't know there's so many things that you could have man but it's just something that you want to have to say i am certified i'm more than that you know like you can't question these dogs something that they can't take from you this is just burning the fluck away huh what is it? My goodness, it's about to smoke me out of here. Wow. <sighs> 
but yeah, that's why it's about to smoke me out of here in this group, most specifically, because you want to smoke some old energy out. Like, this is what I'm saying. It's like a big change. Like, this is like 818 on the timer. That's another time that I called out in group number one. That is so interesting. So let me know if you are open to it. Like, what is it that you want to start new? What is it that you want to walk away from? What is it that you want to take control of? It, that's honestly what it is, is wanting to feel like you have more control in a situation. All right, so this is all that I have for you, group number two. This is how we need to adjust your vision a little bit to help you see how you can get back to ground zero, be more at peace, and feel like you kind of know what's going on even when you don't, all right? So this is all that I have for you. If you'd like to book a personal reading, hit the very first link in the description box, goddessoftheunknown.com to book your personal reading today. But this is all that I have for you. And let's go ahead and get into group number three. Group number three, the smallest letters at the bottom. I have to say that this is subconscious for you, okay? It's subconscious, but it's going to be formulating something new right before your eyes here. But there's some sort of subconscious reprogramming that we need to adjust your vision towards. Let's see. We have the Knight of Wands. All right. Okay, so this is giving me like rushing towards this finish line. Uh, what is this that just flipped over? Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles, okay. Um, I'm getting that there's like some sort of like running towards a certain finish line and there's a big payout at the end, okay. Um, Tell me more about this. I'm not seeing why this is negative right now, necessarily needing to be readjusted. We have the Page of Pentacles. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm hearing um, what will you do with it when you have it, okay? There's something, uh, it's like we're, we're, we're reaching towards something and I'm getting that we can learn something more about this. I need clarification on the King of Swords in the reverse. Okay, the Ten of Swords, Seven of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like, uh, what will you do with it now that you've been met with it? Okay, give me one card to clarify the King of Swords reverse. It's almost as if we're looking for a specific direction here. Like like we race towards this finish line. Like we prepared for this race and we are about to win. And it's like, yeah, okay, we're we're on track to win the prize, but do we know what to do with it once this happens? Okay, yeah, it's almost like I'm getting um like once the birth actually starts occurring, like will you know what to do, okay? something about like once it actually happens like when that water breaks five of swords yeah like something about working under pressure okay the queen of cups something about this is like doing yourself a favor now this is like doing yourself a favor now um, in preparation for something for the future. Yeah, building blocks, exactly. Like, it's doing something now. Um, this could be, uh, with the Ten of Pentacles here, this could be financial planning or um, hunting, seeking, searching. This could be um, an apartment, um, a home, a job. Um, I'm also getting, like, a new routine, like, uh, like a new grocery store, like, new gardens, new produce, I don't know, like, new, new supermarkets, okay? And then we have Not For You at the bottom of the deck here. Um, this is kind of giving me, like, testing trial and error. Um, that Not For You came out, I think it was in group number one, so you could have been drawn there. I think that group number one is one of the anchoring groups for these, uh, readings today. Um, talk to me about this. What is this about? What is this about? 
Okay, first card, we have the Widower in the reverse. Okay, so this is definitely talking about some sort of further commitment here. Um, kind of like being prepared before something occurs, like insurance, okay, for some. Um, what else? Give me something else here. And then we have service. Okay. This is, again, wanting to do yourself some sort of favor to make something a little bit easier. Yeah, too. Um, like, this is like sharpening your skills, sharpening your, your, your knife, if you will, in some aspect here. This is subconsciously you are wanting to learn something new or try something new. Um, and it's directly related to the direction that you are already headed into. Let me further unfold this story. Give me more with the Five of Swords. That's clarifying the King of Swords reverse. What is this about? Wanting to be more prepared for something. And this is definitely in the future, okay? The Six of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like this could definitely be about um, knowing when to give or take. Uh, this is giving me like bank finances um, or your energetic bank knowing what to give to, who to give to, when to give, when not to give. Yeah, the Ace of Swords. This is definitely um, just a desire for new knowledge, like subconscious reprogramming in regards to something very specific that you are, again, already on the path towards, but you are um, trying to prepare for it before you get it all um, or just trying to prepare period okay so this is what i have for you group number three this is again most likely sub something subconscious maybe you thought of something that could be directly or indirectly related to what it is that you are trying to bubble up to the surface with right now but your vision is being adjusted to something in your subconscious that is desiring to be mm, included for the long haul there's something about longevity here wanting to be able to contribute to some sort of legacy this ten of pentacles could be actual finances or something that you want to learn something that you want to pass down whatever the case may be if you know what this could be or if you you have something to say let me know comment section down below group number three what's the story here what is the tea what's it all about all right but this is where uh spirit wanted to adjust your vision to focus something on the subconscious some sort of truth um some sort of new decision to make you feel more sure of yourself all right um i kind of get this energy of like feeling like people have been able to like take a jab at you in a, in a certain place like it's almost like maybe you don't like that someone made a comment about your weight I don't know why anybody would actually do that but you know some people might and so instead of you getting like upset about it you are like you know what I have been complaining about my little flabs over here or I have been saying I wanted to do this so let me just take this as motivation to go and do it you know like I'm seeing you um you could be potentially taking that uh direction as well so I'll leave this reading right here if you'd like to book a personal reading hit the very first link in the description box to goddessofunknown.com to book your personal reading today but that's all that I have for you until next time take care be well bye I'll take you, I'll take